Andros and Otto. And we're here on HGTV. We tell you what's up. So let's jump into the calendar for this week. Doss, you want to start off? Okay. On the 13th, we have boys and girls basketball doubleheader versus Westington Springs in Springs. Starting at 4, JV starts at 4. Uh, tomorrow, Friday, the 14th, there is enhancement. And on the 15th, we have another doubleheader, girls and boys um, against Langford in Tulare. Starting at 1, I believe. So quite a early game. Games. Um, Sunday the 16th, it is Colin Flea's birthday. Happy birthday. Um, and then on Monday the 17th, we have junior high girls basketball and boys basketball versus Iroquois. But isn't that canceled? I Something with that is canceled, I think. I don't think that's happening anymore. And Evan Whiff's birthday and Xavier Spinsby's birthday. So happy birthday to them. Uh, the 18th, uh, girls basketball and boys basketball versus Iroquois. That's at Iroquois, no, right? Ipswich. Oh, Ipswich. Yeah, that's at Ipswich, right? Yep. So girls basketball and boys basketball at Ipswich, doubleheader. Uh, what times do those start? Probably four again. Probably four again. And it's also Sawyer Miller's birthday that day, too. On the 19th, we don't have anything. And then the 20th, we have another doubleheader versus Redfield Dolan in Redfield. It'll start at probably around four. And then Friday, um, 21st, that's our long last week for Christmas break. It's the end of the first semester. And we get out at noon, I think. That day. So quite a busy week coming up. And then on the 22nd, we have Rayanna Knox's birthday and Zoe Close's birthday. And on the 30th, we have Easton Otto's birthday and Ashley Mast's birthday. And it's all over break. And I think, oh, the girls basketball. Uh, 26th, oh, yeah. 26th, uh, it's Ashton Arthur's and Samson Waldner's birthdays. And we got some basketball games over the Christmas break. On the 28th and 29th is the Huron Classic. Girls are on the 28th and boys are on the 29th. I heard that the girls were playing <clears throat> Coleman Egan and the boys were playing Miller, Miller at, seven. at 7 and girls play at 5.30. And it's Jenea Ward Wartz's birthday, so happy birthday to them. Kind of skipped around a little bit. So... We'll jump into our elementary interviews. Yep. Hi, I'm Trajan Free, and I'm here with Rhea Cole. Hi, Rhea. Can you say hi? What grade are you in? You don't know? Kindergarten. She's in kindergarten. What are you learning in kindergarten? Reading. Reading? Oh, cool. What do you do out at recess? Play. What do you play? Like tag and stuff? Yeah. All right. So Peyton. Hi, this is Peyton Nelson. I'm here with Tucker Gilbert. How are you doing? Good. Uh, what grade are you in? Third. What are you doing in class today? Math. Uh, you like math? Yep. What do you do at recess? Tag. Tag's fun. You looking forward to Christmas? Yeah. It's about two weeks away, I think. You excited? What did you ask for for Christmas? Um, a ranger. A ranger? Like one you can ride? Yeah. Those are cool. All right, thank you. Over to Dawson. Hi, my name is Dawson, and I'm here with Tess. Hi, Tess. Hi. What grade are you in? Fourth. Uh, what are you learning in fourth grade? Mm, fractions. Sounds very fun. Um, what do you do at out recess? Soccer with my friends. Even funner, right? Um, what did you ask Santa for Christmas? A phone. What kind of phone? I don't know. <laughs> you don't know? Okay, thank you. Back to you. Thank you for those interviews. So, uh, we have two interviews with uh, Presley Bringer and uh, Cambry McNeil about their FCCLA project that they did. Uh, the 11th. It was at the doubleheader, the first doubleheader yes, at uh, Hitchcock. Sanborn. About cutting hair. So, over there. Over there. Hi, my name is Dawson Otto, and I'm here with Presley Bringer and Cambry McNeil. Hi, guys. Um, so you guys did your FCCLA project on Tuesday. How'd that go? Good. What did you guys do? We donated our hair for children with hair loss. Um, how many inches did you have to have? Well, you have to have at least eight. Um, why did you guys do that? It was a good cause, and we raised a lot of money for the organization we chose. How many people donated so far? Do you guys know? Because I know there's like a lot of hair. Yeah, yeah, there's a lot of hair 
over maybe 10 there's over like 10, 10 people. yeah wow i was yeah i was gonna say there's quite a few well thank you guys thank you for those interview for that interview so i think that's all we have on this week's edition of hgtv so remember uh be awesome be awesome not average, average.